Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Karima and I have a family of three. So I am a mother of one. It is me and my daughter and my hubby. My daughter's name is Jamila and my hubby's name is Rashad. And of course, my name is Karima again. Um, if you are new here, let me know down inside of the comments box down below introduce yourself and if you also create content on here because i know there are a lot of moms on here that actually do create content i would love to get to know you and you get to know me let me know more about you if you do have a channel let me know you have a channel so i can support you over on there so we're gonna hop right into the video today i am going to be recording a shop with me at Walmart. So today we are going to be shopping at Walmart. I'm going to show you all what I purchased from Walmart. If you've seen my thumbnail, you've seen that I have spent over $350 in food. Um, yeah, so I just want to show you all what I got from Walmart, how me and my family are free to eat, and how we're surviving this pandemic <laughs> in the house with food. So that's what I'm going to be recording for you guys today. I really hope that you like this video. And if you do, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to my channel. And also hit the bell notification so you can be notified every single time when I upload. And without further ado, we're going to get right into the video. I like to clean my refrigerator and I love to clean my kitchen. I hate going food shopping and come back to a dirty kitchen and a dirty refrigerator. So I love to make sure that... All of the old produce that we've had the previous week before, such as fruits or veggies, I like to put them in freezers, Ziploc bags. All right, and so now I'm gonna show you guys what I purchased from Walmart. The first thing I got was some cheese pizza and I got a rising crust three meat pizza. Um, the Three meat pizza is for my hubby, and the cheese pizza is for me and Jamila. I got Gorton's fish sticks. This is the family pack of 52. Normally, I don't get the fish sticks. I get the filet, 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 but I made a mistake and picked these up. I got some blueberries for my smoothies, some gluten-free dino nuggets for Mila. I got some seasoned french french fried potatoes i got some seasoned french fries and i got some waffle cut french fries those are both for lunches as well and i also brought mila some trolls world tour cut out sugar cookie dough so i thought it would be really cute if we did this together since we are home um i want to start baking a little bit more and I got my hubby some spicy hot 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 lumberjack smoked sausages. I got oh, and I got some homestyle waffles. I also have another pack inside of the kitchen um, for the refrigerator. I put one in the freezer and then one in the refrigerator. I got some CPAC popcorn shrimp. These are a staple. Normally I would eat these with a salad for lunch or I'll pop these in the oven with some fries for lunch or sometimes I'll have this for a dinner as well. I got some cinnamon toast sticks. These are for breakfast. I got some meatless meatballs. I wanna try these out. I've never, ever, ever had them. I got some veggie meat lovers burgers. But yeah, it's the veggie meat lovers burgers by Morningstar and I also got some Morningstar Farms veggie sausage wings. Uh, I'm going to show you all what I got for my refrigerator items. I got some string cheese mozzarella for Mila and it comes 36 in a pack. I also got her some frozen gogurts. She actually really loved these. I also got me some Kobe Jack and Monentree Jack mild cheddar cheese for my little snacking extra large white eggs and i got two percent milk for my hubby i thought she would really like these so that's why i got these these are um extra cheesy cheesy 
pizza lunchables. It's a quick lunch where I don't have to put much together. I'll make this hard, throw it in the microwave and throw a vegetable or some carrots or celery or something with it and it's a quick meal for her. Um, same as here, I throw a quick celery with it with some applesauce probably. That's a lunchable. So I got two of each for those. And I got some Parmesan, sharp cheddar, taco blend, because we're going to eat tacos this week. Some mozzarella cheese. And I also got me some original um, Greek strawberry cheesecake yogurt. Hopefully those are good. I've never had them. I think I've had it once. I just don't remember the taste of it. And I got some silk, very free, half and half. It's creamy oat milk and coconut. This is my... Um, coffee creamer or tea creamer for me and I got me some unsweetened almond milk vanilla that's for me as well and I got some biscuits and I got some but these were temp temptation basically I seen them it was the last one and I picked it up because I've never had it before but these are grand cinnamon rolls with strawberry cream flavored icing and then I got some Croissants, two in a pack. Those would be for breakfast as well. As well as the waffles back here. I got some waffles that I told you before for the refrigerator. And these little character drinks, um, she has about six or seven of them now, but I wanted to get her a little bit more of them. These are for Mila. She really liked these. And I like filling them up for her, honestly. So I got her a Minnie Mouse, Olaf. I don't know who this was. I just picked it up because it looked cute with a little pineapple and the flower on it. A little joke for my hubby's side of the family. And I got my hubby some Italian sweet cream coffee creamer. I got some heavy whipping cream because I wanted to make some ice cream homemade. I got a um, melon and another melon. So watermelon and a yellow melon. I got some aloe because my skin has been breaking out bad very very bad so I got me some aloe for my skin make me a little aloe paste um, I got some strawberries I'm gonna rinse these off and I gotta rinse all the produce actually but I got some peppers lemons tomatoes, um, some celery, I got some pink lady apples, these are for Mila, these are also for Mila for her snacking, some black grapes, these are really good, I really like the black grapes, um, they're really really sweet. Now moving on to the cabinet food, I got some noodles, I got six of them, these are really lunches honestly, so I got six of them. The shrimp ones are mine. As I told you before, I am on a pescatarian lifestyle and my hubby has the spicy chicken ones. So I got three of each for the both of us. And I got some go-go squeeze. Some go-go squeeze for Mila. I got two of them and they have different flavors in it. So that's why I got two of them, which is perfect. I got some apple cinnamon, fruit, neutral grain bars, and also some strawberries. I got some maple syrup. What's that? Barbecue honey, honey barbecue. So I got two things of um, Alfredo because I realized I had four cans of tomato sauce, but no Alfredo, so I got two of those. I ran out of minced garlic, so I got some more minced garlic. I got my hubby, he eats the thick and chunky salsa, so I got him these with the chips. I got some more ketchup because we needed more ketchup. And I got these too. Normally I don't buy these. I haven't bought these in a while actually. But I got creamy garlic shells and broccoli and cheddar. These are two quick meals I can throw together and dinner will be ready. Um... I got some vegetarian corn muffin mix, and I got some taco shells, I got two of them, and I got Mila some dinosaur park pasta. 
So I got that for Mila. And I got some more pancake waffle mix. Oh! And I also got my hubby some cinnamon toasters. He really likes cinnamon toast cereal and I think it's um, Tony the Tiger Frosted Flakes. Um, for Mila, I got her some alphabet cookies. She really likes those. She likes to actually say her ABCs with them. So I think those, I think those are really cute when she do eat those. And I got some buttery rounds, crackers. I also got some butter smooth crackers. I'll eat these as far as like snacking. And these are more like with my meals. Like if I have a noodle or um, a soup or something, I'll eat these. And these are more of a snack and cracker. Um, I got some Quaker Chewy Yogurt Bars for Mila as well. And I got her some Animal Cookies Frosted. And I got some Sweet and Salty 20 Packs Variety Pack of Kebler. And I got another one back there as well. And I got some peanut butter on cheese sandwich crackers, some peanut butter crackers. Those are for Mila. And I got some Oreo things for my hubby. He actually liked those, learned that recently. And double stuffed Oreos. I normally put cookies in here every week, so that's where these will be going. I got some marshmallows because I wanted to do a little campfire indoors. And I got some more coffee. I got some extra butter, great value popcorn. Um, since being on quarantine, normally I wouldn't get this big box, but I think I've gotten it twice already. Maybe three times, I'm not sure. But we do a lot of movie nights, so that's why I got a big box of popcorn because we're mainly eating popcorn on movie nights and with some candy. So I got a big box of buttered popcorn. And I got me some Honey Bunches of Oats cereal. I also got some chips, some individual bags. Now on to the bacon items. I got some Domino's brown sugar. We're running low on brown sugar. Ah! If you're wondering why I have so many boxes of bacon soda, I actually use bacon soda to clean up the house. Baking soda and vinegar with Dawn Blue Soap and essential oils is my best friend. I also just learned that you can use distilled water and actually make a couple of other cleaning supplies. So I'm going to be making some cleaning supplies. And I got some granulated sugar. I got some fish fry crispy Cajun. And I got some fish fry lemon pepper. And I got some all-purpose flour. I got some semi-sweet mini chocolate chips. I say chocolate like that because that's how Mila say. I got some more milk chocolate. So one is semi and one is milk chocolate. And I got some California Olive Ranch Extra Virgin Olive Oil. Normally I'll pour my oil into here from out of here. So my canned items, I got some um cut green beans cream style corn my hubby actually really loves these i don't like them um i got some more pineapple chunks because he's a pineapple chunk head so i got some more of those and i got some black top pink salmon i got two cans of those and i got some more sweet style corn and these are for me i got some whole corn he eats whole corn too but both of mainly mine. And then I got some cut green beans. Ah! Cut green beans. I got the house some now bananas. I am about to put up all of the food away into the cabinets and into the doesn't treat them right. And also, I wanted to say, I really like this time with my hubby because he actually made a valid point. When he used to work, I would go food shopping by myself and put the food up by myself. And sometimes I'll go food shopping and he'll be home and he'll help me put the food up. But lately, he's been home every single time I've been food shopping. And he would actually help me put up the groceries. And he actually mentioned that it's a good way to spend quality time together. 
and also this is a way that I like to um, clean my produce because I believe that produce is one of the most dirtiest things in the world I just that's just my belief you have many people touching it's just like money I feel like money and produce kind of go in the same category together but um, I like to use baking soda and um, white distilled vinegar but yeah guys this is the end of the video I really hope that you enjoyed the video I am the kind of person who actually likes to see what's in people's fridge as well or to see what they purchased I'm just a nosy bum and I don't know it's intriguing and maybe I'll find you know something that they shop and like oh I like that I'm gonna try that um, yeah so I hope this video gave you some ideas or you try something that I purchased as I mentioned before I am a working in progress pescatarian I've been pescatarian for about 10 weeks now and honestly it's been fun I've, I've had fun with it I've tried so many different things being pescatarian and um i believe that this is something that i do want to do in the long run like literally make it a complete lifestyle change and um yeah so i've been 10 weeks straight with it and i think it's pretty cool i think it really is and if you want to give it a try give it a try if you are not pescatarian that is fine it is okay everyone has their lifestyle that they live and that is completely okay but um yes if you like this video give this video a big thumbs up like comment subscribe hit the bell notification down below so you can be notified when i upload and i will see you guys in my next video